What's up guys? Welcome back to Young Gun Disc Golf from TJ Rodriguez. And um sorry I haven't been able to post videos in a long time. Um I know I've only got like 40 subscribers, but either way I apologize for not releasing videos as often as I should be. Um honestly my biggest reason is that all I'm stuck using is an iPhone 4 to record all my videos. Um that's basically what I've been using throughout this whole um YouTube channel's history or whatever within the past year or so. Um, the video format won't um, cooperate with uh, Windows Movie Maker. Um, the newer version, yeah, but I don't really like using it. I like using the older version, so um, it won't work with that. So I'm just stuck using or uploading straight from straight to YouTube with the iPhone itself. Um, I don't really like that format too much. I'd rather just go in and edit each and every video. Not that um. You know, not that I've been doing that, but if, if I get the chance to do that, then um, I'll, I'll be able to post better quality videos, me throwing more disc reviews and whatnot. It'll just be a lot nicer and cleaner channel overall. Um, that's my biggest reason, though. Uh, Christmas just came up, so uh, hopefully I'll be able to buy some equipment or whatever. Um, my girl's letting me borrow her camera for um, a little bit, um, just on and off. Uh, so I can record videos and actually have a great format for me to edit and whatnot. I might end up buying a tripod just to like um, stick in the ground so that I can you 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 guys will see me um, throw a few discs or whatever for disc reviews and whatnot. Um, that and uh, another big thing coming up um, January. I'm probably going to start posting a video at least once a week. I think that's a good time span for me to release videos. Uh, also, Christmas just came up, obviously, so um, I actually have accumulated, accumulated enough money to um, buy a couple discs or whatever, so I'm going to get um, a couple packages in the mail. Uh, probably it'll get to me by January 10th or so, sometime before that, I'm pretty sure. Uh, it, it's going to be a pretty big disc golf, disc golf haul, and um, I'm going to be posting unboxing videos of um, any packages that come in, in the near future. Or if I end up um, opening it off camera, then I'll show you an in-depth look of what I got um, when I unboxed it. Um, not only that, you know, like I said, there's going to be a few videos coming up soon. Um, one big thing, you guys have seen me um, use this bag before. I actually got a brand new disc golf bag for Christmas. So um, I'm very excited about using it. Actually, I've already used a new disc golf bag over Christmas and it is just the greatest disc golf bag ever made in my opinion that's one of the very first videos that will come up to my channel in January as um, uh, a bag review of this disc golf bag and you know uh, just me showing you this on camera you guys will you know know what I'm talking about when I say that this is probably the standard that all disc golf bags are held at so without further ado, I got a Grip EQ A Series disc golf bag. There is, my, in my opinion, no other disc golf bag better than this one on the market. I was thankful enough to get this for Christmas. It was on sale, so I thought it was a great opportunity to ask. Um, it's just a great overall disc golf bag. Look at the space capacity on the main compartment. Not only that, but um, that's not, I'm just trying to break it in now, just fitting as many as I can in there. That's not even as many as I can, but um, what I like the most is this like little um, pocket on top for me to put um, all my discs or my main putters in or whatever. Um, right now I've got it set to where, you know, they just sink in and I can pretty much zip it up right now. Well, I guess like not all the way, but um, you guys know what I mean. Um, this is just a great overall disc golf bag. I can't wait to do a review for you, um, for you guys. And um, and about uh, maybe next month I might do one in the bag. I plan on doing another one, a more in depth, more um, a more set in stone disc golf bag in, or a disc golf in the bag video sometime in March or April. Um, but January just to you know give you guys a little. Um, peak of what's actually what I'm using right now. Um, 
after the disc golf packages come in, I think I'm going to be switching a lot of stuff out. Like I can already tell you that um, this DX AVR isn't going to stay in. Uh, I don't think the Hydra, as much as it is a staple in my bag, I don't think it's going to stay in. Uh, let's see what else. I got a 150 um, DX Leopard. Uh, it's not going to stay in. And then this one I just put in just to break it in. That's crap. And then I'm going to trade this um, Champion 8 for a Blizzard Champion 8, just a backhand. Uh, other than that, though, I think you know I'm definitely going to get some nice plastic for um, for Chris or for uh, with my Christmas money. Overall, I can't wait till next. Um, I can't wait till next month when I post videos more often than I am right now. Uh, um, I appreciate you guys' patience. I'm sure you guys really haven't noticed me being gone, but um, if you have, then I'm back, guys. I will be back in the month of January. Just um, be sure to watch out for me on your subscription. Um, other than that, though, I appreciate it, guys. Um, just please subscribe if you want, if you haven't already. And um, starting next year in general, I'm planning on doing maybe a disc golf giveaway or two uh, I'll probably you know have the options to do that um, next year so it'll be really good it's next year it's gonna be a big year for young gun disc golf and my um, my goals at the end of uh, at the end of I want to say about April or May I want to have at least or I hope to have a hundred subscribers so overall I appreciate it guys hopefully you watched to the end of the video um, other than that I'll see you guys in January peace out thanks for watching Young Gun Disc Golf aka TJ Rodriguez signing out